All right. Now we're doing free code camp, JavaScript algorithms, and data structures beta. Learn basic JavaScript by building a role playing game. Step 55. All right. So now we're going to give our empty button text array three string elements. We're going to use the three strings being assigned to the button inner text properties in the go town function. And we're also going to remember that array values are separated by commas. Very true. All right. So we're going to be using the three strings being assigned to the button inner text properties in the go town function. All right. So we've got the go town function here. And we're going to get go to K, pardon me, go to store. Whoops. We're going to get go to store like this. We'll put it in here. We're going to have a comma after that in this space. And then we'll do go to K. Copy that. Drop it off. Comma space. That's not a comma. Comma space. And then we'll do fight dragon right here. Copy that. Drop it off right here. All right. So now that we got this going on, uh, pretty soon, what are we going to do? So what we're working on here is we're working to replace all this stuff. Like you see how it's all the same, but the dip, but the uh, values are sort of different. Uh, what we're going to do, what we're doing is, to, pardon me, what we're doing is we're working on replacing this stuff so that we'll say like, uh, this is going to be button text at zero, button text at one, button text at two. No matter what, you know, whenever we get, uh, whenever whenever we assign these names, right? So something like that. So let's check the code. Looks good. And submit it. All right. Now we're on to step 56. And we'll see you next time.